Yeah, you do have braids. Go, go, go. 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 I want this car seat. You want that car seat? Yeah. Okay. Looked back out, my parents, and both of them were just sobbing. <laughs> Okay, chat fam. Finally, finally, we're able to do what we've been wanting to do for so long. We got the Sprinter van and we haven't used it yet because we needed car seats. So I'm gonna quickly explain what we had to wait for because now they're all here and we're taking our first little mini trip, just a little ride tonight with the whole family. But we were waiting for two more car seats. We have the, so in the van, we have the three on the back. I fit those three back there. They are so extremely tight that there is no wiggle room. They were so hard to get in that we knew that we would never wanna like go back there and take them out. And it would be so hard. So we left all those three there. And then we have another car seat in the front in the van. And then we have Gemma's old car seat, which is the same thing, the Nuna exec. All the car seats are a Nuna exec. It's our favorite car seat. Kara did all the research and apparently they are the safest and they're building something over there. So that's the pounding. But they have like the highest safety rating. They, they are a little pricey, but you can't put a price on safety in case of an accident. So if you get in an accident, at least our kids are, are comfortable, okay? No, I'm kidding. We're not gonna get in an accident, but that's what it's for. So we had like the safest ones. We love the Nuna execs. So we have four Nuna execs in the minivan, three in the back and one in the front. So the one in the front, the captain seat, I can easily take that out. And we have Gemma's old Nuna exec that's in Kara's Jeep Cherokee. I can take that out. So we could easily swap two. So we needed two extra permanent ones for the minivan. That's what we waited for. We bought two Nuna execs. They're on back order and they finally got in. We got a different color too. They finally arrived. So both of them are here. Now let's go see how we're gonna situate it. And honestly, it took a long time to like figure out how we want to situate all the car seats in here. But me and Carrie came out here for like a good 30 minutes, switched everything around and we came up with, I think what we're gonna keep for the car seat situation in the Sprinter. Let's check it out. There we go. We got empty seat for an adult, empty seat for an adult. Asher boy, really close to us so Carrie can reach back and feed him. And we'll put the, we have a little mirror that we'll put right there so we can look back and see his face, see if he's sleeping or not. Row two, we have our old car seats. Nuna exec one, Nuna exec two. You can see the, the food stains so you know that those are old. But well, these are the ones that we're gonna switch in and out of the cars. Basically just one of them, unless Kara wants to go somewhere in her Jeep. If you go in the minivan, we just have to take this one out and put it in the minivan and then we're good to go. And back here, these are the new car seats. So we got a different color. I like this color a lot. So there we have it. Ah, I got my camera on the dash. So that's the car seat situation. So what we also like about it is that all the kids are spread out. In the minivan, lately they are just fighting or just grabbing each other or just taking each other's toys or food. So we took advantage of all the space we have in here to separate them so that it doesn't happen anymore. So they can't reach each other. And as far as which kid is gonna go where, we don't know. We're just gonna open up the doors tonight and see like where each the kid goes. And then we'll just say, okay, that's your spot. We actually switch them up anyways, except for Gemma stays in her car seat since we have to raise it a little higher because she's taller. There you go, folks. You can fit our whole family in the car, but we are so stoked to go on a road trip. And coming up soon, we are headed to California to visit Chad and Ashley. Chad's gonna teach me how to surf. So stay tuned for some wipeout vlogs. I'll take a GoPro with me. Family bike rides in California, A. Eh? So it's gonna be super fun and it's gonna be the first road trip in the vehicle and don't forget the best part here we come the flip down tv baby all right the kids are already coming out oh my gosh hey <laughs> look at how cool are you guys excited yeah. hey are you guys ready to go on our reese are you ready to go on our first family ride yeah <laughs> yeah you do have braids okay let's see where they all go all right where's everyone going royal go go, go. go, go get in a car seat you want that car seat? Yeah. Okay. Reese chose this car seat. Reese, the only problem is that's not a car seat. Huh? That's not a car seat. I'll go in this car seat too. Okay, this is Asher boy. Now here's a quick view of all the car seats. Asher, two kids, two kids. And it's already loud. Let's go. Going on the maiden voyage. The maiden With all voyage. The kids. Yeah. It's already a party bus. Okay, go now. It's crazy. Okay, you gotta get in the car seat. <laughs> No, you and Reese are not in car seat. Okay, let's, okay, let's put up. Asher in his car seat. First baby. Let's go, baby. Right? Yes. Okay. Thumbs up. Are you ready to go? Go. Thumbs up. 
I'm here. Boom. Boom. <laughs> Reese and Gemma are making their way across the movie theater aisle. Reese, you're so close. You have to go right there. Good job, Reese. Get in your seat. You guys have the new car seats, Gemma. You guys are so lucky. All through the town. We've been singing that song a lot. Pia's like, don't leave without me. We got you, Pia. We're singing the wheels on the bus because we have our big bus. And look at how cute everyone fits in here. Everyone has plenty of room. I know. Look at all the space. If we have people with us, they still have a lot of room. Like, I know. Look at all you guys. I got this cool carrier, too. This right here. It's like a basket, so we finally have some stuff we can put our stuff in. Flip the TV down and... Yeah, let's party! We need to get Pia a little bed in here. I know, let's get Pia's bed. We're going on our first family voyage. Gonna go get some ice cream. Definitely not eating it in the new, in the new Sprinter, in the new car seats. That gives me anxiety. We'll wait a, a little bit before we start eating in that car. Wish us luck. It's gonna be fun and our first road trip is coming up real soon. So make sure you come back and see the first road trip in that van. It's gonna be fun. We just pulled up to my brother's church. We are practicing a song, but he beat me here. So let's go inside. So we are here in church with twin bro so real quick we came to church because we're practicing we're actually playing this song tomorrow in church it's a duet that we played years ago on our missions we both went to argentina but different parts and then we reunited after 18 months of not seeing each other and played this song for like a ton a ton of people and we played tomorrow so we're just practicing i thought i'd bring the camera along so you guys could hear the song as well it's called my heavenly father loves me he does <laughs>
Welcome back, chat fam. Welcome back, <laughs> chat fam. Welcome back. You guys, look at this. First of all, let's address the elephant in the room slash lion in the room. <laughs> me? You're talking about me? Asher. Asher boy. Kara got this. We Asher. just got it in the mail. <laughs> I wanted to talk about a little bit about when we played that piano piece because currently, that was a little bit ago because we just got home from a road trip. We just got back from California and those vlogs are coming up with Disneyland. So this was a couple weeks prior, but, but we're catching up. We are catching up, you guys. Sorry about the next delay. I know we've been off schedule. I just want to tell you guys about when we played that piano piece because my parents had no idea that we were going to play it. And like I said earlier, my brother and I practiced that like 10 years ago and we played it on our church missions in Argentina. For some reason, that song always made my parents cry. Like they just, because I think it just, seeing both their sons at the piano and then it was especially right before we left on our missions they knew they weren't going to see us for two years so we just planned that where dylan had me come up i went and sat with you know with my parents and then he started like playing a solo and my parents had no idea that i wasn't even gonna be there or play the piano and that oh that's your boy after my brother played his solo for a few minutes then i walked up sat next to him and then we played that duet. So after we were done, I looked back out at my parents and both of them were just sobbing. <laughs> like they were just like ugly crying, <laughs> especially my father. So Rick is the super softy. He is Tender the- Tender little sweetie pie. Isn't he just such a crybaby? Yeah. Asher gets his crybabiness from- All of my too. manly softness and emotions <laughs> and my soft side comes from Rick Chatwin. So he was just bawling and he always just cries so much because he says like, I, I missed my boys. That, that was when we left for two years. And now it just kind of reminded him of that. So it was super cool to surprise my parents. It was like a super special day for them. So it was a super special day for us. I love seeing my parents, not crying, but just happy and proud. So that was really cool. And they really enjoyed it. Okay. Asher, show me the tricks. Asher has a few tricks that he can do. I don't know if he'll do them right now because he's a little distracted, but ready Asher? Can you say bye-bye? Bye bye. Wave. Wave. Say bye bye. <laughs> and then he can clap, clap, clap your hands. Clap, clap, clap. Yay. Clap. Can you clap? Clap, clap, clap. Clap your hands. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye. And he can um, laugh like a witch, like all the kids do <laughs> <laughs> for Halloween. I should say, ha, ha, ha. Ha ha ha! Oh, there we go! Ha ha ha! Wow! Stay tuned for the upcoming vlogs of California and us traveling in the Sprinter van. It was so nice, seriously, like most comfortable ride. And Disneyland, we ended up going without Ashley and Chad. So that made it a little bit more difficult because two hands, five little kids. So it was hard, but really fun. The kids had so much fun. They're at the perfect ages where it's just like pure magic. We've had people say like, why do you take them to Disneyland at this age? It's a waste of money. They're not gonna remember it. Gemma actually does remember going when she was the triplets age. And I mean, maybe she won't remember it for her whole entire life, like that specific trip. But they remember the magic of it. They have so much fun and just being there and like living through your child's eyes, like at Disneyland at these ages is so priceless. It really is. Like they are at the perfect ages where everything is real. Everything is magical. The princesses, the characters, they just love all of it and just soak it all in. And as parents, like what more could you want than experiencing that with your children? It's just- I thought it was super magical and extremely difficult. And stay tuned for that vlog because- Yeah, it was really hard for us. And I can't even believe I even <laughs> vlogged. Like you'll see, it's- Yeah, I don't know how much you even vlogged. I don't even remember. It's not the most the quality whirlwind. because of the crazy, but it, it was awesome. And that whole trip was awesome. So stay tuned for those upcoming road trip vlogs and Disneyland. Thanks for being a part of the family and joining us. And sorry for the long delays. I'm gonna start getting back on schedule, but yeah, he I is, ain't making right? no promises. I'm just gonna try. We love you, chat fam. We will see you next time. Good night. Oh, Rashford, oh look at that lion boy. You good daddy's hair. <laughs> <laughs> good night. This is our world. This is our time. 
These are our plans We're gonna let them shine This is our place In the human race